Hi guys, long time no chat. Um, I'm actually eating a piece of sweet and my um, nose is um, a little bit nasal or rather my voice is a little bit nasal because I just um, got out of hospital and I realized that I haven't been YouTubing a lot mainly because uh, I moved back from Australia to Singapore and then there was a Christmas and the New Year's and now Valentine's Day is over and yeah well we are here um, doing another update and this is going to be part of uh, whatever I've got since then plus a little bit of what I've panned and uh, a little bit of a candle haul a very teeny tiny mini one um, so let's get right to it and pardon my sucking sounds because there's a sweet in my mouth okay um Oops, let me show you like the first thing that I'm very excited to pan. This is the Raspberry Resurfacing Peel by Akona. And this thing took me quite some time to pan because you can't really use it like every week. For At least for me, it doesn't work that way because it's kind of harsh. So this is a really good product for uh, a chemical exfoliant. And um, after that, you you know do a mask on and stuff like that and it really feels good so this is uh, something that I've really you know I'm very glad to pen second product I've pen is the St. Ives moisturizing in shower exfoliating body polish I like this particular one uh, the oatmeal and shea butter one over the collagen one they have and um, I like how the oatmeal feels against your skin so this is a really good buy if you you know you can get it at drugstores anywhere it's really cheap at least to me the thing that I've just panned today is the Joyco K-Pack restructuring shampoo and I got this in Australia before my move back I, I love the smell of it um, they don't sell it uh, at supermarkets or drugstores here in Singapore but um, there are still some Joyco uh, salons that carry this brand so um, I'll be looking out for this and I also paint a sample size version of the uh, Body Shop Rainforest Balance uh, shampoo for oily hair and it really smells like olives and I guess this one is not too bad uh, coupled with its conditioner um, a few other things I've panned are, uh, you know, a tiny bottle just like this of uh, Hana Labo uh, Super Hyaluronic Acid. I think that's correct. Um, that one is pretty good and I've done away with my packet of uh, Beauty Diary Black Pearl Mask. And I'm now onto my Q10 mask. Uh, that's some of the stuff that I've used and um, also I finished Crabtree and Evelyn's body wash in coriander and citrus lemon or something like that that's my dog there he's come to join us hi Yuki okay and yeah thereabouts so that's all that I've pan and I'm gonna pan my MAC press powder studio finish foundation soon yeah I guess that's about it and here uh, I know this has been a uh, YouTube craze for quite some time but they've only just recently uh, launched in Singapore they are the Revlon lip butters I've got mine in macaroon fig jam and brown sugar I'm currently using this one. I've not opened this two at all, but overall the feel on your lips is kind of good. So I'm definitely liking this for every day. So that's that. And my latest nail polish stuff that I've got is Nail Envy. It's a nail strengthener because my nail is really, really um, brittle. And I've got three new OPIs. This is in. Funny Bunny, which I'm quite disappointed that it's like uh, white because I intentional, um, I've tried to get a, a really light pink, but 
I didn't know that you know it kind of looks white but anyway I'm kind of glad to get this too because um, I really hated Essie's Blanc the formulation is just not right for me I can't get it like smooth in one go so I'm really glad to have this the next one is also a YouTube favorite I guess is um, You Don't Know Jocks I, I like this one and also Nicole Alert which is uh, looking very orangey here but actually this is more like an orange pink and moving on to my candles, I have Harmony um, Crystal Candle in Lavender Aroma with an Amity Stone inside and this was given to me by uh, a friend who just uh, came back from Australia and the Amity Stone is like here, you can see it so can't wait to burn this because you know, you guys know that I love lavender and of course I did a mini candle haul uh, spree uh, I've got some of the Christmas scents and this is homemade cookies and this was on I don't know how many percent off but I have another mini one uh, it's burning in the toilet right now and it's uh, gingerbread I tried to get like loads of others but they are sold out before I can get my hands on them so so this is it all that I have um, Oh yeah, one more thing, I finished my Vichy moisturizer and I'm now going to attempt to go through my Laniche moisturizer. So that's about it and um, I hope you guys have been good girls and you know really putting your um, money where it's well spent because I don't believe in buying products and not using them all the way so let's see how we'll do in uh, my lipstick pen project which I am embarking on and uh, we'll do an update much later okay see ya bye